Welcome to the beer review of me, Jake. So if you're now joining us, we've just had a reminder of a classic from Adnams. It's Adnams Broadside. The reason we did that is because Adnams have released both barrels, which is a barrel-aged version of Broadside. So I wanted to remind myself what this one was like before I cracked into this new beer because I haven't had Broadside in a while. So if you missed that video, here's a link somewhere, link in the description, link around here somewhere. But let's get into this. So lovely bottle with a nice flip top cap. Let's scoot that across a little bit. Yeah, so this is oak aged in bourbon barrels. Sent it thinks to six years oak aged in barrels. And also um, been aged over cherries as well. So poof. And it makes it ramps the ABV right up to 10%. So standard broadside is 6.3. This is 10. Let's get into Adams. Both barrels. Ooh. Didn't give me the the pop I desired. There it is. Okay, so I mean, in the time it took me to flip that top back on, the head all but disappeared. Let's see if we can generate a little bit more. So thin sliver there, uber dark, really dark now. I mean, this is the standard broadside. It's more sort of red around the edges. This is just that shade darker. The head, um, when it was there, it was pretty much the same color as the normal broadside. On to the aroma. Wow, God. For me, that is just pure Christmas cake mix. It reminds me of my mum's Christmas cake mix. That's just stonking. I mean, the cherries coming through there. Is massive. Get a nice big hit of vanilla, dark fruits, getting red grape in there, some raisin. That smells absolutely storming. Getting a molasses type thing. Does have a, a bourbon edge to it. Reminiscent of like Jim Bean for me. I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm more of a single malt man, but Jim Bean is what's jumping out. Right, on to Flavor Town. That's, I'm going to taste it. That's a storm or a bit. It's almost drinking kind of like a spirit. Get a nice booziness to it, really sort of warming. Sweetness of the cherries hit you. It's then followed up by this lovely aromatic bourbon flavour. It's got vanilla in there. It's even got a little like hint of chocolate in there. It's got like a little bit of a chocolate sweetness as well. Getting some burnt toffee malt coming through. This tastes like an, a really uber aged beer sort of fresh out the bottom. I mean, they've aged it themselves for like six years. So this is just crazy. Very different. I don't think I've drunk anything quite like this. I mean, you can't particularly see it, but the alcohol legs on there, it looks like, it, I mean, it looks like a spirit in the glass, especially having it in one of these small tasting glasses. So this is the both barrels. This is the broadside that I poured for the previous video. And when you jump back to it, I mean, you can tell that they're sort of, the both barrels, it comes from this beer. It's just this is heightened, this is amped up, this has got, they've added some crazy flavours with the bourbon and the cherries. But you are just, it, they're both just huge malt bombs with a nice red berry quality already. And then they've just amped up. That was everything from Adnams Both Barrels, which is an oak age broadside coming in at 10%. My name's Jake, remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next review. Cheers.